Hello all. Today we will be discussing, we will be actually implementing a project which is called as age and gender estimator, sorry, age estimator and gender classification project. So where we will be classifying genders like male or female and along with that we'll also be specifying the age. We'll try to predict the age of a particular person. So in this particular uh, project, uh, we will just see, we'll just go through the code. And I have an HDFI file which I have trained on more than 10,000 images so that it will be easily able to classify the images, right? Classify the images based on gender and well, gender that is male and female. So what we have to do is that this particular file size is around 186.7 MB. So I am going to provide you this file link in the description box. You have to download it and the remaining code is present in my GitHub link which I'll be providing you in the YouTube video description uh, uh, in the description box. What you have to do is that you have to clone all this particular code and then you have to download this H5 file, that is this HDF5 file and you have to just paste it inside the pre-trained pre underscore models folder. Now, as we continue, as we continue guys, you should always remember in this particular uh, project, I'm going to use Keras. So make sure that you have Keras installed if you don't have any Keras, uh, so and and the Python version that I've used is 3.6. So what you have to do if, in order to install Keras, you just go to Anaconda prompt. You go to Anaconda prompt, just type down as Conda install you know, Keras. As, as soon as you do this, automatically Keras with the TensorFlow will get installed. If the TensorFlow is not getting installed, you have to manually install TensorFlow again separately by just writing, typing it down as Conda install TensorFlow. Two libraries are basically used because this whole code is based on that. And this is the most important file that is my weight file because this is the weight. Um, and here I've basically used a ResNet, a ResNet neural network that is ResNet layers and this is the code out here. So let me just go through the code once again. Okay. So first of all, I'm going to also use OpenCV. So please make sure that you have installed OpenCV uh, because OpenCV is necessary to see the images, capture the images through my webcam. And then I will be able to, you know, predict whether it is male or female and along with that we'll be specifying ages also. So let's go through the code. First of all, I've given the path of my hard cascade frontal face and this is also present inside my pre-trained models. After that, I've also given my weight paths over here. And this is basically created in, in the way, uh, basically I've created in the form of classes. So this is my class that is face CV. And based on this, I've created other, all the other things over here, different, different function doing different, different things. <clears throat> so to begin with, I'll just start with the main function. So here is my main function. As soon as this is called, I'm going to call this particular main function. And then here I'm calling this face CV method. As soon as I call face CV method, it is going to, pick up my hair cascade frontal face dot uh, XML file and then my weights file. After I get this guys, I will be, you know, calling first of all this initialization method where we'll be loading all the weights in my neural networks and the neural network code that is my ResNet code is basically written over here. It is basically a two layers convolution neural network in which I've also used batch normalization and I've also used something called as average pooling tool. Okay, instead of max pooling or min pooling, I've done average pooling and it was able to give me a very good results. So I'll just try to execute this particular code and, you know, show you how the output will look like. So to begin with, I'll just execute this code. So I'm going to execute the whole thing. As soon as the camera will get opened, you'll be able to see that uh, my face will be easily detected. Along with that, it will say me whether I'm a male and the approximate age and yes my age is somewhere around 27 to 28 and it is giving me a very good result till then and this was the whole code behind it and again guys you can use this weight file that i'll be providing you the description from where you have to download in my description box this is a pretty cool project uh, by using residual network the, sorry resnet network which is my new neural network over here that i have used and this is completely done by keras Please try to do this project, understand the code in this, and you can actually put it in your resume that you, you have this kind of project so that whenever you go for an interview stuff at that time, you can showcase them this kind of things. 
so i hope you like this particular video uh, i'll see you all in the next video please try to do this and happy learning thank you all